hello guys welcome back to my channel so today i brought a very special and very different uh, kind of video that you can win the defense from uh, k40 attack so k40 uh, players they definitely have uh, high buffs and a lot of things so on the left hand side is a weak player 1.6 billion only but with the uh, very good layers of the troops and right hand side is very strong and uh, spent a lot of money already but he's very good with the the buffs but how did he defeat this guy the big player without re reinforcement you can see that and also i show you the the buffs so you can see here on the left uh, left hand side he's a weak and but on the right hand side he's a strong and the buffs are like you can see huge difference but still he won the defense and this guy ranked three on our server in server war so you can defeat these guys the big players with the the small settings so i'm going to share with you guys start working on those things and my this friend he shared me his details and uh, little information he gave me that i'm going to share with you guys and definitely it works for you as well okay <clears throat> let's start with uh, the layers i'm going to start from the the bottom and please pause the video note down the the numbers of the the layers that you can uh, to work on because uh, i'm not sure i can write down in the 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 uh, description area this much information but uh, i can suggest you that you can pause the video note down the numbers of the layers you need to defeat these guys do not uh, use a lot of mounted troops if you have a lot of mounted troops you must like high level I, I would say that like a high level mounted troops you must coast them with the martial law, then come out of the bubbles or truce agreement so here we go so this is the level two to three the next one and i have to finish up so quickly this video the last video i made it was too long but i don't want to make too long two videos it takes longer to upload on the youtube for me all right so here we go level uh, six to seven eight to nine So you can see he's ghosting his uh, mounted troops but he didn't ghost the other layers so you can uh, copy so leave a little bit mounted troops just for the layers like a uh, hundred thousand each uh, level of the the mounted troops same like uh, this guy did So here we go, the last one. Okay, so if you don't have a uh, high level troops, don't worry, but start with the, the bottom, from the bottom. Train T1 traps. Everyone knows about the T1 traps. Now I can show you so you can have a look. He did 2.255 million. Uh, T1 uh, horses so you can choose like you can train the other ones other like archers ground troops or sage machines as well but work start working from the bottom then go up but copy the layers if you want to defeat the the high level players and I'm going to share with you the other settings okay so now you need you don't have to worry about the good defense general you need but make sure 
that the general you're going to use he has a good equipment refining plus he has when you activate the star levels to so choose those generals which does does which doesn't cost any money to to buy them like in the relics you can get this general which i'm going to share with you so have a, here we go kusunoki masasagi so here we go mounted troop attack make sure refining is not in percentage you don't need refining in percentage because when people attack on you so their equipments can debuff only percentage so if there is no percentage you don't get debuff and you win the defense easily so their debuff settings on the equipments like uh, plantation uh, equipments they are purchasing and they're using their refine very good and uh, it doesn't work the debuff doesn't work so here we go hp in numbers you can see all the numbers he's using this was awesome i was shocked that how did he uh win the defense and rank three already without attacking so you can see all the numbers on the equipments here we go <coughs> he activated four stars already so he will work on the fifth one very soon but he when he activated the four stars you can see in city mounted troop attack 25 percent in city troop defense all type of troop defense 10 percent on the fourth star but mounted troop hp 20 percent and in city troop defense 15 percent another in city mounted troop attack 20 in city range troop and attack and 30 by 35 percent when general is the main city defense general okay so this general or uh, not this one okay so use your dragon if you don't have dragon don't worry you can use the godzilla beast on your defense general but if you have this dragon so make sure you refine mounted troop hp in numbers not in percentage and his le dragon level is eight only you can see he is really like awesome man he did a really good job okay the last thing i'm going to share with you which was new for me but never knew someone asked me in the video comment area which is the beast works on uh, the the subsidy generals or not yes you can see he applied the the beast he tested himself then he shared the information yes apply your beast on your generals subsidy generals before going to the battlefield because beast works and give huge difference and a good debuff for the the enemies so thanks guys thanks for watching have a good one enjoy your game and best of luck your very good game and good defense hope you win the good defenses and uh, rank top five in svs the server war or get required scores in boge and boc all right guys have a good one enjoy your game